So yeah, this is the updated state of my showroom. Yeah, uh, it's not finished, but I would say that it really starting uh, to take shape. So uh, yeah, I will uh, tell something about it uh, in a bit, but first I want to show you everything. Sorry, I'm a little bit out of breath because I spent the entire day uh, working here today. So, yeah. Okay, so now a little description. Uh, what I did today and uh, what is new. So, I bought the new vitrine and I put it right there. And as you can see, I already put the Endeavor there. Uh, it was done in order to cover uh, the mess behind it and but as you can see there are still some cables visible but I plan to do something about that in the future. Also uh, I bought this uh, uh, yeah, uh, shelf system for some small things uh, as you can see uh, currently I have their keys and some uh, tools uh, then uh, I hung those two shelves. Uh, I already originally had them uh, in my living room, but now uh, they are uh, here. Then, as you can see, I moved this table here. Yeah, it was originally there, but now uh, it is here, and there are already uh, chargers for the lights for the uh, diorama and uh, the uh, extender and the uh, LED lights. So, as you can see. Uh, those two uh, shelvings have uh, the uh, LED behind them. So, yeah, uh, and of course, uh, another thing, I uh, bought a fan because that's simply a must have. Yeah, so uh, basically today, yeah, and uh, this vitrine was moved here, it was originally uh, there. So, yeah, uh, it is now here next to the fan. Here uh, we have the Star Trek. Uh, display plate and as you can see here yeah i bought another uh display stand so uh now all the enterprises are just in those two uh, levels with the f still missing and here we have a place for yeah here we have the defined and uh voyager and the bottom is completely empty so still quite a lot of space here and here uh, as you can see uh the destiny uh is the new uh yeah, uh, uh, well, uh, it's placed here because uh, it was originally uh, at my uh, living room, but that place is now taken by the uh, BC uh, 303 Daedalus, yeah. this one, but the big one. So I brought it here, and basically this is the ancient shelf, yeah, those two 302 and uh, 301 kind of break it, so I'm still thinking about putting them down. Because as you may notice, I have removed all the gold stuff and I put it here uh, to the table plus the diorama. So, yeah. Oh, okay. So I would say that for now, uh, yeah, this is it. Uh, yeah, there, at least for now, I think that there is a lot of uh, still uh, free space to use. So for now, I think I am done when it comes to the display, display place. So, uh, yeah, I may have played around a little bit more with the LED lights and put some uh, also here uh, or here. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah. This is my... Oh, I forgot to mention and uh, one other thing which I did uh, is here uh, with the figurine Roman. Um, uh, it fell down, yeah, uh, I guess it's not meant to be uh, wearing an armor, so uh, yeah, one day I came here and he was lying here, uh, and yeah, so uh, what I did, I actually uh, strapped him uh, to the wall, and uh, not only that, but I also uh, finished the side uh, uh, armor here, so yeah. It is now, uh, let's say, more complete than before. Okay, uh, yeah. Uh, as you can see, uh, he does not have the ring rings. Sorry, 
uh, those are still here because they don't fit to the figurine hands or fingers sorry uh, so I've been thinking about printing a hand that would actually have the uh, the rings but that's still for the future okay then I suppose that's it and yeah we will see each other in the next video have a nice day and bye bye